If the wind and my sail on the sea stays behind me, one day I'll know. If I go, there's just no telling how far I'll go. I know everybody on this island seems so happy on this island. Everything is by design. I know everybody on this island has a role on this island, so maybe I can roll with mine. I can lead with pride, I can make us strong, I'll be satisfied if I play along with the voice inside, sings a different song, what is wrong with me? See the light as it shines on the sea, it's blinding, but no harm knows, how deep it goes, and it seems like it's calling out to me, come find me, and let me know, what's beyond that line, will I cross that line, see the line where the sky meets the sea, it calls me, no one knows. Hi, this is Angela Taylor with Taylor Homestead Soap. And that song was from, you guessed it, Moana. So the soap that I'm going to be doing today is based on the story, the movie, Moana. So what you're gonna see here are the islands um, with, they have huge amounts of vegetation on the islands. So you're gonna see the vegetation on the islands and it butts right up to the ocean. So the top of the, the top of the soap are the waves meeting the island vegetation line. Um, I'm, I'm part of about 65 sofas who are um, involved in this collaboration. Um, if you look down, there'll be a hashtag. If you click on that hashtag, you'll get to see all the other fabulous sofas. Please go to their channels, like, subscribe, make a comment to their channels as well. If you like what you see, please subscribe to my channel, give me a big thumbs up, and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching. This Moana soap today, we will be using the fragrance oil, ooh, ready? Sweet orange oil. I'm using it for two reasons. Number one, um, Moana, I don't know, it reminds me of oranges and tropical fruits and all of that because it's set on an island. And because sweet orange oil I have found slows down trace. Awesome sauce since I will be doing some swirly stuff in here. So two reasons to use this good stuff. Now I want to show you my lye water. It's a little um, yellow and the reason that it's yellow is because I did not use purified water today. I used aloe vera juice, not gel, but the juice from aloe vera. Here we go. The very first thing you do is you put in the lye water solution. divided my batch into three different batches and I'm going to put this is let's see here this is called indigo girls by mad micas and I'm just it was a sampler pack so I'm going to use the entire amount make it pretty dark and I'll show you why in just a minute so Moana is set on an island surrounded by water lots of ocean water right yes you knew that all right so Mixy mixies. Actually, I think I may need a little more soap than that. So we're going to put some of this in here. Alrighty, do some more mixy mixies. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put some of this. This is just some older soap that I had that I crumbled up, um, chopped up to be exact. I'm going to put this inside here and you'll see why. Yep, using it all. Alrighty. So I'm just going to mix this up in here like so. I'm going to pour this into here partially, but not completely. And I'll show you why. Cool, huh? All right, now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put these in beds in. They're just, now this is bendy soap. Um, this is so much fun, you guys. 
So what you do is you put this, I did seven ounces of melt and pour base soap, and then I put an ounce of vegetable glycerin. The vegetable glycerin makes your soap bendy, so you can bend it over like this. Isn't that cool? All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this in the bottom here, and then I'm going to cover it up with the rest of my soap, all right? Here we go with the first layer. So this particular collaboration um, is asking for two different distinct layers. So the first layer um, is obvious, but now what I'm gonna do with the second layer is um, I'm trying to make it look like ocean water. You'll see what I mean in a minute. So watch this. All right, so this is new leaf green and this is gonna be for the top of my soap. I'm making, um, this is going to be part of a piping that I do. And um, I need the piping to start setting up now because this takes forever, forever to set up. Anna, what she talks about are she does a lot of talking about um, the horizon, although she doesn't call it the horizon. So this is gonna have lots of what I call, mic they're like mica lines, but I'm really kind of making them horizons. So, see how cool that is? I'm going mixy, mixy. I do not want this setting up with this. I don't want this to set up anymore. <laughs> and then this one I'm gonna put Aphrodite. Ooh. All right, so I'm gonna do the in the pot swirl type deal. I'm gonna do one of these. Whee! Looks like a painting. So, the pouring on this is really very important. I'll show you why here in a minute. I don't want it to necessarily break that. And I want it to be all nice and swishy together. But here's the other thing I want. I'll show you here. All right, I don't want it really even either. I turn it this way so that's not super even here. And I'm gonna ooh do one of these. And I'm gonna make some divots in here because I want it to have a mica line but I do not want the Michael line to be even at all. There it's focused, all right. So now I'm gonna try, look how cool that is. Looks like a painting! I think what I do now is turn it back this way and try to get some soap down here in this edgy piece here. All right, next I gotta work on the piping, but this piping, mm, it's probably not set up real great yet. That's okay. All right, we are to the cutting of this soap. You can see I've got my Lush, um, you can see the, here that I've got my Lush Island line here that's coming right up to the ocean. And we're gonna cut this now, yes, we are. All right, shall we see what it looks like on the inside? Ooh. 
Uh oh. Here's the inside. So you can see all the different mica lines in there. There's one, two, three mica lines in there. Ooh, that's cool. Look at that. See here, you got a mica line here and a mica line there. So the goal is to get lots of mica lines in there. And there's the top. Lines, look at that. Mica line, mica line, mica line. Lots of mica lines, see? More mica lines there. And the top. Right, here's this one. Moana soap. And remember, you are loved. Go be a blessing for someone else today. Mm -hmm.